Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. I'll be making a potent antimicrobial shot. This shot is antibacterial, antiviral, antifungal and antiparasite. I'll be using all organic ingredients because organic ingredients are free from fertilizers, pesticides and GMOs. So my first ingredient is two tablespoons of organic cloves. I'm going to use manuka honey. I'll be using two tablespoons of manuka honey. I have some organic gingers. You can use some medium size or as much as you like. And also I have my organic unpasteurized apple cider vinegar with the mother, which means it contains the bacterial and the enzyme is not filtered. I'm going to use one medium size of organic lemon, 15 cloves of organic garlic. So if you have the bigger cloves, you can use 10. I am going to be using 15 because I have the smaller cloves. The next for me to do is to share the benefits of each ingredient I'll be using in my video. These are garlics. I'll be using 15 cloves of organic garlics. If you have a bigger cloves, you can use 10 cloves. Garlic helps with the prevention of cancer. It helps reduce cholesterol level. It has antibacterial properties. It helps suppress viral, fungal, and protozoan growth. It helps detox the body. These are my organic ginger. So I'm using this much because ginger will give my immune shot a good test and flavor. So I'm using this much. So and ginger has anti-inflammatory properties. It helps lower the blood pressure. It helps lower blood sugar. It supports the liver and also supports the immune system. My next ingredient is lemon. Lemon is a great source of vitamin C, fiber, minerals, and essential oil. Lemon helps reduce or prevent kidney stones. Lemon contains small amounts of iron and also helps with iron absorption. It also helps reduce the risk of some types of cancer and due to its vitamin C content, it helps with immune function. This is unpasteurized organic apple cider vinegar. Apple cider vinegar helps lower blood sugar. It improves symptoms of diabetes. It helps kill harmful bacteria and boost skin health. So I'll be washing some of my ingredients and measuring out the others and pouring them into my blender to blend. I have with me Manuka honey. Manuka has antibacterial, antioxidant and anti-inflammatory properties. It is made up of sugar and fructose and amino acid. It contains some minerals and vitamins that are very good for the body. It has hydrogen peroxide compound. It aids digestion and soothes coughs. So I'll be using two tablespoons of manuka honey and I'll be using a wooden spoon instead of a metal spoon because the compounds in honey leaches metal into our food when scooped with it. This is my organic cloves. I'll be using two tablespoons of organic cloves. Cloves has antimicrobial properties. It helps reduce the toxicity created by pathogens in the body. It helps improve peptic ulcers and it also have anti-cancer, anti-inflammatory properties. I'm ready to wash my ingredients. As you can see, I have them separated into three bowls. I have my cloves in separate bowl, my garlic cloves in separate bowl, my ginger and lemon in another bowl. This is to help me wash them thoroughly. And if you don't have organic ingredients, you can still use them. This should not stop you from making your potent antimicrobial shot. But you can use baking soda and white vinegar to wash them. All you need to do is 
to soak them in water and add your baking soda and white vinegar for at least 10 to 15 minutes and you wash and drain. So now I'll wash my ingredients. So I'm pouring my cloves here. Have my cloves here, I'm pouring my cloves, my blender. So I'm pouring my garlic. I'm going to put my ginger now. So what I'm going to do next is to cut my lemon into four chunks. So I have my ingredients in my blender. And this is what my ingredients look like when blended. So I'm going to let it rest for 15 minutes, like I mentioned earlier, to allow all the phytonutrients in all my ingredients to be released into the water before sifting it. This is what my filtered ingredients for the potent antimicrobial shots look like. This microbial shots will be stored in the refrigerator for four days. However, you can store it between three and five days, depending on how you prepare it. Also, in case you want to get rid of bacteria, fungi, viruses, and parasites and looking at detoxifying your system, this antimicrobial shot is the best. And it's very good for cold and flu season to help support your immune system. And I would encourage every one of us to try this shot at home and put your comment in the comment section below and tell me what you think about this drink. Thank you for watching. Bye.